Hey guys, welcome to another video. In today's video, we are going to be talking about Powell. So yeah, I got this notification on the Powell Discord from Bucky. So it looks like they have a new Google document called Power World FAQ and Troubleshooting Guide. So let's dive into this and see what this actually is. Okay, so what I'll do is I'll put the uh, Google link down in the description down below so you guys can see this for yourself. Okay, so we got, a, uh, we got some subsections here. Intro, contact info, about streaming and video content, multiplayer, troubleshooting in general, and frequently asked questions. So I'm not gonna like completely go through this like word for word, cause this looks like a pretty dense document here, but I'll give you guys kind of like a, like a, like an overall, like look at this real quick. So we got the first part is the intro, basically thanking us for purchasing early access. So the, the big key thing in this uh, particular paragraph is they have a save data recovery system. So if we go to section 5.1, reverting save data with backups, that'll get us uh, basically, that'll get you guys in the steps of troubleshooting because this game is in early access. So bugs and weird stuff are going to happen, unfortunately. So it's very nice that the devs are already working on documents here to basically help us out. And then uh, number two is contact info. They got the uh, invite to their discord. Many players participate here. And if you got quick questions and concerns, a lot of the community members will answer uh, a lot of quick questions. And then also there's a general feedback in bug testing. So if you actually go into the game itself, uh, you can look at the screen here under options and then contact. You're welcome to, uh, you know, for feedback and bug reports. Uh, I definitely have already done this myself. Uh, there's a couple of, you know, pieces of feedback. I personally, the, I think the storage is a little too small, but there's, there's a lot of other things. I definitely will be filling out for more additional feedback. So if you guys want to get your voice heard, definitely, you know, give some feedback or you might experience a bug, especially like that crazy bug that gym leader Ed had <laughs> where you, you jumped on top of, of the uh, spear and when it was caught, it launches you up. Definitely, uh, you know, definitely a crazy bug there. Okay, so they also talk about a Steam discussion board. I'm going to be honest. That discussion board is, I've, I've with how much traffic there is right now, it's it's fifty fifty right now. It, it's like it might it might not even be up and running because it's so busy on there. And then uh, another good place to go is to their uh, Twitter or X. I, I'm still can't get over the the naming of X. And then if you guys want to send them a email, you could do it the old snail mail way. Go to support at pocketpair.jp. And then section three uh, is basically talking about you can, I mean, it's kind of common sense here. You are able to, uh, you are free to post videos and stream of Power World regardless of re whether uh, it generates revenue. Obviously, they do have some guidelines. You can go right here. It's just common sense stuff like, you know, no propaganda, no political stuff. I mean, it, almost every game is like that. So just common sense stuff. And then section four, multiplayer. So the multiplayer mode is currently under development. And then it basically explains how to play co-op multiplayer and then how to play multiplayer dedicated server. So if you guys want me to go into detail in another video, let me know down below and I'll definitely, uh, I could definitely uh, draft up a video and get that out there for you guys. But they have some, some basic stuff here to be a host player, create the world, obviously do your world settings. But yeah, I'm just gonna kind of just go through, kind of skim through this, but 
I'll definitely have the link down below. So if you guys want to read this at a little slower pace. <laughs> and then how to play multiplayer dedicated server. Okay. This is probably an important part. Troubleshooting in multiplayer. Power World is the game under development. Yep. You may experience some features don't work as they're intended. Characters get stuck in terrain or in between objects. Please restart the game and log in again when necessary. Obviously, like what we said earlier, submit bug reports. If you don't tell them what's wrong with it, they won't, they won't be able to fix it. <laughs> this is what I, I really appreciate is them actually giving some basic troubleshooting here, which is section five, reverting save data with backup so if you guys are using the uh, generic directory or save location, it's going to be under C, users, username, app data. I'm not going to bore you guys, but they got all the information there. Basically, you can copy and paste uh, or override your old save backups. It's really, really nice that they actually have this all documented here. So basically inside the save data directory, you'll find player data and world data. And then also you'll find backup folder in the same directory. But yeah, if you guys want me to go like further into detail into each section, let me know down below. I just figured, I just wanted to show you guys this resource more than actually going through word for word because this could probably be like a, a two hour video if I broke everything down really complicated and deep. And then uh, section six here is frequently asked questions. The game crashes upon launch. And then they basically, you know, give you some troubleshooting here. Powell doesn't function well with the security software Norton. Uh, if you guys have Norn on your computer, please remove it. It's junk. It, it's bloat. It doesn't work. It doesn't get rid of viruses. Honestly, it causes more issue than anything else. And then how can I do PVP? They're basically explaining PVP is still under development. So basically everything is PVE right now. And then they got an Xbox. Is the Xbox PC version available? The Xbox PC is available and can be played day one via purchasing on Xbox Game Pass. Crossplay is available in the following pattern, Xbox and Xbox, and then PC version. And then we are planning to support the following cross play patterns in the future updates, Xbox and Steam. So it looks like Xbox to Xbox or PC to PC, at least that's what they're saying. And then here's some beginner tips. I'm not gonna bore you guys. Uh, one of the ones they have here is the night is too dark and cold. Their answer is by building a campfire and, steer, and staying near it or holding a portable torch. You can withstand the cold and darkness. Also, if all players sleep in the bed, you could rest until morning and skip the night. But yeah, I'm not gonna read all of the beginner tips here. But I can definitely make a video here because these are actually pretty solid tips. Or it's very possible someone's already made a video on these, but we'll definitely... Uh, I might actually make a video in the near future. So if you guys want me to make a video on these uh, these uh, pocket pair tips here, I can definitely do that. But I think that is the rest of this document here. Yeah, that looks like the rest of the document here. But yeah, I just wanted to give you guys this resource because at this point, like there's a lot of information and you might be experiencing some save data issues. I just wanted to give you guys this information. I'll definitely have it down in the description down below. But if you guys want me to go like into details in, on a particular section or subject regarding this document, 
Let me know down below. But other than that, I will see you guys in the next one. Take care, guys.